Conquering Conjunctions, your ultimate guide to grammar junctions. Hello language learners. Welcome to another exciting episode in our Grammar Fundamentals series. Today, we'll dive into the riveting world of conjunctions, focusing specifically on understanding their types and their role in creating complex, nuanced English sentences. So, let's kick things off with the basics. Conjunctions are words that connect or link phrases, words, or clauses. They are the glue that holds the sentences together and gives them more depth and complexity. They're classified into three main types, coordinating conjunctions, subordinating conjunctions, and correlative conjunctions. Let's explore each of these categories in the following sections. The first type we'll discuss is coordinating conjunctions. These are words like and, but, or, so, for, yet, and, nor. Remember the acronym FANBOYS? It stands for for, and, nor, but, or, yet, so, and it's a great way to remember them. These conjunctions are used to connect words, phrases, or clauses of equal rank. For example, I love pizza, but I don't like anchovies. Next up, we have subordinating conjunctions. They're used to connect a dependent clause, also known as a subordinate clause, to an independent clause. These include words like, although, because, since, unless, and many others. They create sentences with more depth, such as, I'll go to the store unless it starts to rain. Finally, we have correlative conjunctions. These work in pairs to join sentences or parts of sentences. Common pairs include, eitherer, neitherner, not only but also, and, bothened. They work together to balance sentences, as in, I can either go for a run or stay home and read. So, there you have it. The types of conjunctions in English. Understanding and using these conjunctions correctly will allow you to create more complex and interesting sentences. They really are the ties that bind our thoughts together in language. Don't forget to practice, as practice makes perfect. And remember, the key to mastering any language is consistency and persistence. In the next video, we'll be looking at punctuation rules associated with these conjunctions. Until then, happy learning and keep exploring the fascinating world of English grammar.